This video will show you how to add an internet port to your router. This is how you do it. First you need to know your router model. Connect your router to your computer. Open route. Type your model here. Log in to the TP-Link Web Administration web page. Under System Tools select Firmware Upgrade. Browse to the previously downloaded star.bin file. Click Upgrade. In this video I practice with Huawei Onu, other types are the same. Connect the computer to Huawei Onu with Ethernet cable. Log in to Huawei Onu as above. Connect Huawei's LAN 4 port with TP-Link's WAN port. Connect TP-Link's LAN 4 port with your computer. Connect to HTTP colon slash slash 192.168.1.1 with your web browser. Go to Network then Interface. Edit. Protocol PPPoE. Enter your internet account. One is up. Go to system then software. Update lists. One three. Install MWAN3 package. MWAN3 Install Lucy app MWAN3 package.
Go to network then switch. Remove a single physical port from the default VLAN 1, this port will be the new physical WAN 2 port. Assign the port to a new VLAN number such as 3 and set the port to be untagged in this single new VLAN and off in all other VLANs. Note this VLAN, as with all VLANs, should also include the built-in CPU port as a tagged member, so there are a total of two ports in the new VLAN. Connect Huawei's LAN 3 port with TP-Link's LAN 1 port. Go to network then interfaces and add a new interface name for the new WAN port. Name the new WAN physical interface WAN. Enter your internet account. This account is the same on both WAN ports. Assign the new WANP interface to the WAN firewall zone. WAN is the default WAN interface in this example, and so we'll get a metric of 10. WANP is the second WAN interface in this example, and so we'll get the metric of 20. Reboot the router for the new WAN port to become active. WAN is up and WAN is up. Wireless settings Load balancing settings
Hope this video will help you. Thanks for watching, don't forget like and subscribe. Help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribe.